Welcome back to Change Special Edition. It's been slightly updated, so there might be a small video, small content update. I don't know how much. I'm just a little bit tired, and I also want to give one update to one thing. Is I don't want people asking me for more Changed. If you watch this video, keep this very much in mind. I'll likely end this video, and then there'll be no content. Like, I, I get people that are like, Nico, why aren't you making more change? It's like, did you watch the last episode? Like, I made the episode, and the demo literally ended. So it's like, how can I make more content on a game that doesn't, like, you know, the content doesn't exist? If a game updates, I play it. If I finish playing it and I don't make episodes, it's clearly because there's no more content. So I'm trying to make sense with people who are like, Nico, make more changes! Like, there's no more! You to, like, the developer can't just be... Then the developer's like, there's more content, bam, 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 bam! It doesn't work like that, and I don't make the game, so it's based on, you know, Snow Dragon, or Dragon Snow. You know, as soon as he makes content and shares it, then I can play it. But, so, for anyone that's like, watches this, don't ask for more. More will come when more comes. But I think this is only going to be one episode. Because I, I don't, you know, we haven't given him much time to uh, work on everything. So anyways, we're going through the oranges and seeing what's changed. And then everything ahead from here. So let's just try to survive this. The orange. I went back a little bit. So I have to survive this. Uh, let's just let's just save it again, though. But yeah, I I, don't, I think this will just be a one episode thing. Oh, part forty. We'll see. We'll see. Nah. He's hidden in there. Oh yeah, and I can't step in the middle. Hmm. Okay, so here would be, yeah, let's see if it's changed. The the weird, voring plant makes him look like a penis head. But then it just sort of ends out sort of okay. This hasn't changed, I don't think. But that still looks weird as hell. Alright, let's see if anything's changed with... Oh, that was quick. He's still waiting there. Hmm, questionable. Nope. Nothing's changed. <laughs> yeah, the plots. I forgot about that. Congratulations, you finally got the right ending. No, 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 no. The, the right ending is at the end when you hit escape. Otherwise, I'm gonna say this room is done and hasn't really changed at all, so we're gonna move ahead. Everything he says is probably hasn't been changed as well. This room would be... brand new, though. Yep. The robot. This is brand new stuff now. I almost forgot about this Iron Lump's existence. After all, I haven't visited the greenhouse for years. This futuristic-looking robot was actually just a prototype for mass production of household robots. Before this building was used to study latex beasts, it was also rented by another technology company as a robotics laboratory. After the emergency ex expropriation of this building, many not yet publicly announced machines were left here. Have to say, the sweeping robots they developed are very convenient, but this prototype's AI version is really low. Even the early education machine in the library is smarter than it. <laughs> Prototype. Do you have any special features? Can you present your ability to, to the subject in front of you? As long as it doesn't bend over. Huh? It can change its... Hair, I guess? Can you do something more useful? Even my dishwasher <laughs> exceeds you. Oh! Oh, God. That, that is quite a good burn, I will say. That, that sounds like something I should tell to any of my enemies now. Even my dishwasher exceeds you. I don't have a dishwasher, though. I need a dishwasher, so then I can legitimately say my dishwasher exceeds you. This, uh, it's a good insult. 
My oven doesn't exceed people. It's so old. My oven cannot exceed my own enemies. My online enemies. So many online enemies that exist. They need to be told that my dishwasher exceeds them. My future dishwasher in time and space that does not exist yet, but when it does, it will exceed my enemies. But yeah, can you think of a way to obstruct this subject in front of you from moving forward? By hiding in the bushes? Oh, the traffic cones. Smart. Okay. This is indeed a kind of obstruction. This time I'll be sure to make my demands clear. Can you, in any way, turn the subject into a Lee Takes Beast? And make him stay naively and obediently in this building? Oh. I don't trust that. He's gonna throw a latex beast at me. It is! <laughs> it looks so confused! <laughs> it's like, wait, what? This robot's picking me up. I loved its facial expression. Although that's not what I had in mind. It's close enough. Of course, I wasn't expecting it to do anything actually useful. You should take back that... The, that uh, it clearly has surpassed... A dishwasher. A dishwasher can't move a green... Lizard uh, latex beast? No. Let me save. I did really like its expression as it was carried, though. I I'll have to see if that should be the thumbnail or something else. Sweeping robot. It doesn't love me. Wait, what? Why doesn't the robot love me? All the other ones give me hearts. Thick and twisted vines. Stationary intercom. Gas. Hmm. Oh. Squirrels! Oh god! It's not gonna convert me, are they? Ah, but okay, never mind. Why are they still crawling all over my body? That's weird, man. Oh, squirrels. Oh, they all went into the tail. That is one big tail. And he went right after that shit. He's like, oh god, fluffy tail. Prototype. Can you applaud the subject for me? Enough. Stop knocking on your metal arm. That is pretty funny. Jeez. It's like Dr. K and the robot make a, make a du good duo. It's like sort of like Pinky and the brain. Like, seriously. Pinky in the brain is, is the perfect comparison. But no, seriously, how am I supposed to avoid these squirrels? Am I supposed to rush? Nah. No, get away. Hey, can you, like, how do I get these fuckers off? Plant. How do I avoid them? They just chase me. Do I have to use the gas? All right, I'll have to skip this. I swear on Snow Dragon's Patreon, he said that they pop out when you rush through the... Maybe it's because I ruffled the... oranges. Hmm, so to stop moving? Ah! Damn it. Wait, fusion? I'll see if there's a fusion, or squirrels, then the lizard. Maybe we'll get a... A transfer. Alright, I don't think there's a transfer with the lizard, then the squirrel. Alright, let's try squirrels and then lizard. Squirrels? I'll just hop on me. Yep. Nope. The lizard just doesn't even try to touch me. Alright, now let's actually try to get through the shrubs. First, We have to go, like, one step at a time. Alright. He's a little close. Oh, wait, what? He's still... Wow, this might be a little difficult. Like, legit, I've, like, tried to lure him down. I'm gonna have to, I guess, lure him even further. 
Like, he's up there, but if I just keep moving left, he'll reach me almost instantly. So, let's see. I'll move here. Now, he should... I should be fine going here, but... We'll see. I hate you squirrels so much. Okay, he's behind me. Damn squirrel. Squirrels. Alright, so now we find out where he is here. Is there no lizard in this shrub? Are you going to let this human get out of here? Are you really going to turn a blind eye to this walking hazard? You marvelous machine created by countless engineers. Use your processor. Think of a solution plan. Show your worth. Oh, wait. Blue screen. Uh oh. Overworked that processor. No. Next time I'll turn to my microwave for help. At least my microwave can heat up my dinner. Damn. Don't roast the robot like that. Uh, oh no. Uh, I wasn't expecting the one on the right to actually rock out of the right shrubs. All right, well this is good. Well, this is this is this is perfect. They're out of the shrubs, which is maybe a bug. Like they legit exited the shrubs. I just had to make sure. Uh, I had to go down one. Shit. I hope I can keep, just keep going left. Once more. Shit, I can't. We're clear? Holy shit, we're clear. Alright. Alright, well he loves me. That's good. Or she, I don't, I don't know. Plant. Plant. Ah, that one loves me. All right, now I was curious about this thing. Do you want to create a new white goo creature template? Sure. I'm curious about this. I saw it a bunch in the oh, Patreon. Preparation complete. As long as it doesn't transfer me, I'm curious on, please input the instructions on the operational panel. Like, I don't know. Ah, years. Eyes. Oh god. We gotta make a sassy and sexy one. Or that guy from My Hero Academia or Tintin. Um Oh yeah, next scruff. Eh. Mmm. Okay, we're we're gonna try to make one serious. Mmm. Hmm. hmm. Fluffy, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sharp claws, yeah, that's pretty good. More fluff, that's that's better. Even more fluff, that's even better. Big tail. Big macho. Like, not, not standing on it. It's three tails. Um, hmm. Maybe. So much. Ah, boobies. B bigger boobies. Bigger belly. Oh, he's ripped, but he's still got the fluff. <laughs> he's all true ripped. <laughs> Gee, uh, oh yeah, just there we go. Wait, mm, no, no, wait, wait. Mm, there we go. Chest scruff. Was oh, this one? Oh no, I don't want to get rid of the. Mm. Fuck it. Insufficient power. Please wait for the generator room to resume normal power. Well, yes. I, I try to make a custom one, but eh. There's just always... Wait, preparation. 
strange. Either way, I don't know. You, you could just craft uh, a white latex creature for fun. Your little buddy finally found out that you went missing. Now he's restlessly looking everywhere for you. I suggest you don't expect him to find his way here. I won't let him ruin our precious time alone. I want to make sure that next time he sees you, you will be an obedient latex beast who obeys my every command. Nah. And maybe I shouldn't say it in such a tasteless way. I'm not one to so happily mock others. It's just that for some reason I have to be mean to you. Got it, troublemaker. Hmm. If you say so. Well, at least there's a save point here. Let me see what has been recorded in your personal data since you woke up. You have taken 13,863 steps in this institute. You really are laid back. That's laid back? It's like you are exploring this place with the attitude of taking a stroll. I don't know why you roam around in this building for ages reluctant to advance. Don't those latex bees scare you at all? But even if you are really that unconcerned, you still manage to get here. I don't think that it is nothing but luck. Then, let's have a look at your saving count. 81 times. It seems like you are quite insecure. This data records all the kinds of situations that you've encountered. I also recorded your sweaty and hurried and that sigh of relief when you finally found a safe place. You recorded a lot of data before punching... But by far, by, on by far most of this data, nothing but your calm face is that the only expression you have right now. Let's add a new piece of data. Uh, I mean... These are like all the saves that have been like compiled both from what I had before and what my game was previously and probably a mix of the data that was left behind by Snow Dragon. It's hard to tell anymore because I've lost my data, reacquired my data, replicated my data. I have no idea how many times I've honestly saved. Hello and welcome to the Intelligent Greenhouse Control Terminal. Please state your wish. Um, internal contact? In the process of transferring you... Successfully connected to Dr. K for you. <gasps> you actually decided to start learning how to make harassment calls. This certainly isn't good behavior. Even if you call me repeatedly, there will be no improvement to your situation. I wish I could, through this terminal, directly turn you into a latex <laughs> to a beast right now with the radio waves. Unfortunately, there's no such technology. I'm going to continue enjoying my tin can dinner. Don't contact me again. Right. Dr. K has hung up. We're definitely going to be harassing him. But let's see. Uh, operate equipment. Operate to... Oh, jeez. Uh, yes. Oh. So I, I, I'm gonna... Please contact the prototype to obtain the greenhouse administration... Oh. The robot in the other room. Okay. At least I can save freely, because I'm pretty sure... We're gonna need some strange gases falling into this room. Ah, strange gas. Well, let's get transferred. That's the soothing gas I carefully prepared for you. Soothing gas. This gas ugh, will relax your mind. And additionally, it can change your body. Don't let my goodwill go to waste. Mm-hmm. Going forward could be really dangerous, but if you can turn off the fans, the gas will dissipate away. Yes, what about these little robots? Boop. Now they are friends. A person-shaped metal slot. Hmm. Alright, well, I'll just keep harassing him, I guess, and figuring out what else I can do. Uh, indoor lighting. Ooh. Moody. Uh, let's put it back on, though. There we go. Mmm. Music! I mean, I, I didn't want to lose the music, that... Okay. Um... View file. One. The truck with the animals has arrived. We put these in a small room in the greenhouse. The genes of these living animal samples will help us find a breakthrough for the virus. I don't quite understand why we still need the genes of aquatic animals, because no one wants to become a fish that can only live in water. Hmm. Well, some do. Not me, though. I want fluff. Fluff is life. The fluid bodies of some rubber animals perfectly conform to the characteristics of non-Newtonian fluid. They can diffuse and rebound physical shock 
to a great extent. At present, only electric shock can stun the latex beasts to some degree. We also use this to subdue those failed products and seal them into jars. Oh. Well, we learned more information. By artificially adding some man-made gas to the air vent of the greenhouse, the employees in the building can be constantly kept in a state of high spirits and concentration. At the same time, it can also improve their heart rate and effectively raise their pulse, reducing the risk. Although, this is not a long-term plan. It sounds a little, uh, questionable. So what is this? The sweeping robot is charging. Oh, that's kind of cute. They have a little charging dock. Can I, like, push them into it? Like, what if, what if I block them right here? Get in there. No. All right. Well, let us save and... Actually, no, we're not going to get the robot and get the permission. We need to harass. We need to continue harassing. Did you know? I can directly adjust the effectiveness of the ventilation fans until overload, and make the entire room fill up with transfer gas in an instant, or directly lock the whole room, draw some more latex beasts to you surrounding you. No matter which way, either could either could effortlessly deal with you, Hazard, but I don't. I want to let you fail and then admit your own failure, instead of giving you no room for decision at all, only able to hopelessly await the end. I really hate to leave people with no choice. At the same time, I also believe that the person who wins in the end will definitely be me. Hmm. And so, before you completely annoy me and make me decide to lock the doors, don't call me again. Hmm. Huh. Maybe he'll give me a unique transfer if I keep harassing him. But okay, we will save and then also deal with this gas. Feels like he's slowly turning. His hair is whitish. He's just mere as head. Hmm. Not finished. Ah, this would be the end of the demo too. Ah, uh, so why isn't the gas transferring me? Wait. Wait, what's with the back of his pants? Wait, what? Is that a tail growing? What? What? What is with? What is with his shorts? Your pupils have become narrow and long like an animal. Yeah, they don't want me to save, do they? It definitely has changed. It's not letting me save, then. <laughs> Look at yourself. Your path has already been decided. There's no turning back here. You make an impression of requiring assistance. <laughs> Wait, is this just like, this is just like soft lock? Huh. Well, I'm guessing this transfer is just not done yet? Because I can't even leave the room. Fresh air is blowing from the vent, making you feel refreshed. Wait, this prototype was left in that small room without AI being installed. We found it when we moved the cages in there. Our engineers temporarily copied the AI of the sweeping robot to it, although we can't count on it to bring any help to our research. At least it can be a gardener. Huh. Well, anyways, I guess I have to restart, because we're not being transferred at all, so, eh. Are you taking revenge on me? Revenge for interrupting you over and over again with transmissions. Revenge for me setting up all kinds of difficult obstacles for you. You finally know my real name, and finally you got a chance to harass me in turn. Okay, this will only inspire me to use more extraordinary ways to turn you into an obedient, well-behaved, sticky little animal. Let's wait and see. Are you sure? Are you sure? We will keep harassing him. No, he's hung up. Hmm. Hmm. Well, maybe he just... The prototype isn't here anymore. Uh-oh. Go find it. There's bunnies! I hope I don't get any wrong ideas. Hmm. I do like bunnies. Mm. Alright, well. Uh, 
Fuck it, oh, the squirrels too. Oh, Jesus Christ, there's so many creatures. I have to dodge the lizards, the rabbits, and the squirrels. Oh, God damn, I, the lizard's there too. I'd be fine if I got the transfer by the rabbits, because then it would at least be a new transfer, but still. Ah, no! No! Get off of me! God damn it. It's not even a new transfer. Well, at least I know how to get by, but... We'll see. Hmm. Human, are you here? Human, where have you gone? The prototype seems to be right ahead. Hmm. Well. Hmm. 42. Where's the rabbits? Bird. Bird? Oh, wait, what? Is that a big bird? <laughs> no. Hmm. All right. Hmm. Now, ah, wait, what? How do you catch up so fast? Oh, 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 I finally, finally got out. Okay. Finally. All right. Wait, what? Oh, he. That fucking robot. I didn't see the shrub that exists. I saw the shrub below his feet. God damn. And save it here, just in case. Hmm. You, come back with me. I need privileges. It seems to understand what you want. This mean like I have to go all the way back through everything. <gasps> More birds? Three of them. <laughs> Wait, what? Why did the birds turn into like a green f wolf? Ah! Get away! All right, we made it through. That's good news. Wait, rabbit? I want a rabbit transfer. Um, wait, what? It... Why? I am so confused. This place is far more lively than I thought. You should be thankful that these little animals are not interested in you. Are you trying to say I can now go on by without hassle? Oh yeah, no, no, they're still there. God, I hate this place so much. Those squirrels, oh jeez. And these things I have to bait. I don't even want to move any further just in case there's a squirrel off the screen that'll come after me. I don't trust them at all. Alright, I'm done. Ugh. Are you sure you want to share the greenhouse administration? Yes. Do it. Now, this operation may cause major safety hazards. According to Article 42 of the Greenhouse Management Regulations, it Please kindly do not make such an expression. That is a... Please kindly do not threaten your colleagues. It will cause me unnecessary stress. Okay. I have shared the GA permissions with this subject for you. Thank you kindly for using... Goodbye. 
who knew the robot could be capable of making some strange expressions. Why, when I give it instructions, it's not so smart anymore? It, I'm nice and he's mean, so he listens to me more, I guess. Alright, with that pain done... Alright, first, we'll try to call him one more time. No. Alright. Then, operate equipment and fans. Ah. I will also save in 43. Just in case when the game gets updated, because the robot is just not here. So, the content, this is it. So, again with the start of the video, for those watching this video, this is the end of the content. I am cannot, I cannot make any more changed videos until it gets updated. I always know when it's updated because I follow Snow Dragon or Dragon Snow, I always mix the two together, on Patreon and Patreon gets updated, Steam does not. Steam gets updated, the special edition, from time to time. It gets like, you know, a, a large update at some point and it hasn't for a while. But the most recent updates will always come from the Patreon. Um, so yeah, I'll play more changed when it gets updated. As for now, this is the end of the content for now. I hope I don't have to repeat myself ever again in the future and people understand how game development works. So, with that, I hope you enjoyed this one episode. We didn't really technically go far, nor were there really many transfers, but we still technically did a lot of stuff somehow. And I got stuck a lot because those shrubs are actually difficult. They're a pain. Once you're able to play through this scene, you'll understand what I mean by the shrubbery being a painful area to be. It's just like dealing with a shark boss fight in the original change. It's just a pain, man. But either way, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a subscriber, and hit the notification down below for updates of my videos. Thank you for watching. Until the next time. Arrgh.